Uh, where should I head to now? Uh, like, we can probably upgrade now. Okay, that's true. Back. Um, do we want to upgrade or do we want to level so that we can put on the legs? Probably want to level first, I would say. Okay, so you're gonna want to take a right. We're gonna have to make it through this acid pit to your right. Oh, this one with yeah. the uh, the angry guy. He's a little angry. I mean, he hangs on an acid pit all day, which can't okay. be great. Well, I'm just gonna. Yeah, just kill him. Get some more scrap. I wish that you got scrap from doing that quest, but you do, you do not. Bow. You think Jennifer would be like, I got some scrap for you. Uh, but, did she give you any reward if you demand it? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. I didn't do it either. I'm not a dick. <laughs> hey, oh, you just watched your boyfriend get disemboweled by Harley Quinn. Please give me all the scrap that you have. There we go. Uh, do I run across? What do I do? Yeah, run across. To your left is where you're going to want to go. Huh? Wait, which like past what it. are pa what are directions? And then left. Down that way. I think this goes into the back alley. Uh paper And then street. take a right. Oh back yeah, okay. The, I, I remember this. Back hmm. into the dead mouse shop. <laughs> you have to exit through the gift shop. Is that a thing? Is that anything? Uh that's a documentary. Mm -hmm. about, about Banksy. Uh, Banksy, yeah. Well not really, it's about uh that guy who wanted to be like Banksy. Okay. Uh, yeah, okay, let's level up. And you got a couple metal scraps. How much do I need to... oh, yeah. I think to upgrade it was about a thousand, so maybe... Because uh, we want to try to get the full aid suit. Yeah. Which, maybe you could even put one leg on. Can okay. I... So how much yeah. do you need for the second leg? Three? No. Four. Mm, you're gonna need one more power... one more level and you can wear it. Oh, really? Yeah. Can you level up right now? Or yeah, I can, yeah. So let's do do a level, and then uh, you can put that last one on. Boom. Uh, and then you can even try to fight little, little Johnny with this. Okay, we'll see how it works. It's only Mark 1, but, you know, it should be... Or is it Mark 2? I can't remember if Gray is Mark 2 or Mark 1. Uh, they're all Mark, mark one. 1, yeah. Okay. Alright. Little, little Johnny goes this way. Hey, I see you got that new aid armor. Those jerks... <laughs> Kicked me out of my neighborhood and now I gotta wear this weird suit. It really does look like Fat Man from MGS2. It does. Yeah. If you t you can actually take off your helmet um, visually, like in the in the settings. Yeah. And you just don't wear a helmet, but like it still counts. I see. Uh, uh, which would even look more like Fat Man, especially if you were a bald dude. Oh no! Oh no! He's going to the boss too. <laughs> oh come on! Oh no! Nice. I kind of, I don't know. I sort of wish that there was co-op in this game. Not that like- Like, like split screen? Or no, like, like uh, online? Like, yeah, like Dark Souls style. Oh, okay. Not that I think that it necessarily needs it, but I always think that it would be fun. All right, let's see if I uh, have any trouble reaching his uh, weak spots with his stubby little weapons now. That's true. Well, if you're just gonna parry first, then he's still gonna be left open. I can't quite, I don't like how I can't tell where those are going to hit. That's true. I think that's the that's the meme. He did that already? Yeah, he does that sometimes. Uh, can I do anything about those? No. You can walk into them and they'll do damage to you. Oh, okay. That's cool, I suppose. But I think they do disappear after a while. It looked like they kind of did. You gotta bait his swings by, like, being in his face. Yeah. Right in, right in my face. You think you're better? You think you're better than me? And then he does that. So the... The parries do count. You can kind of see the shields on his health bar oh, yeah. go down. So there's no like time limit to get the next parry. It's just do three. Oh. That one's always my least favorite one to block is when he like hits you with a front attack. Yeah, bank all those. Bank all those delicious, delicious batteries. I kind of get in the flow now a little bit. Good. Yeah, I think I, the fact that I didn't understand how to fight him, um, I kind of put a, uh, bad spin on this boss, but I think he's actually a pretty decent boss, and once you get good at parries, he's not overly difficult. You want to get out, get the fuck out of dodge. And, as, especially once you find a weapon you like. That is true. All those things are true. I'm sorry I tried to push you towards using spears, my son. That wasn't your fault, I took advantage of them because I could spam them. That's true. But like, 
I, you think you thought that because growing up, I used spears and my dad used spears, and I just <laughs> I just wanted you to use spears too. I wanted you to love spears just like I do. But there's so many other weapons that you can try. This is true. <laughs> I don't oh. know why I have such trouble with the left side ones. I would say you gotta get the fuck out of there. Oh, heal. I can't. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, once, either once you start panicking and lose the rhythm, or if you run out of stamina, just get the fuck out. And I just find the uh, left side one easier to dodge, or easier to parry than the... The right one? Yeah, I don't know why. That's fair. That's fine. Oh, I see. Attacks under his legs like that. Oh, what a douche. Yeah. This guy's just chock full of animations. Yeah, they put a lot of work. I guess I understand why he's on the front cover now. That's true. Uh, I would almost heal just to be sure. Yeah. Just yeah. so you, you go in all prepared. Wow, that one just whiffed. Nice! Alright. Ooh! Sexy. Because, like, at this point it doesn't even look like you've done any damage to him because his health bar is still, oh. like, up. At least I kind of figured out how to, uh, get healing from him now. Mm-hmm. Yeah, doing the... Uh, all the chains that you get after you knock them down are just, like, so many bars. Just full battery bar. I also think at some point you can get your battery higher than three, but I've been pumping into battery efficiency and have not oh. seen it yet. Oh, oh no! He got shecked! It's fine. Okay. Yeah. Oh, you can cut it now. I couldn't. I couldn't. Careful. Careful. Oh, okay, my you're God. In right position. Oh, you're not going to be yeah. able to get in there. Well, I couldn't. I feel like I couldn't even. Yeah, you don't want to get him in that, fuck? like, chain. Okay, calm down. Calm down. You got this. I don't know, dude. Get back into his rhythm. No. How am I supposed to, like, I, do I have to, like, basically parry? I don't understand how I'm supposed to cut off the arm. Uh, so you can either try to slip it between his attacks, or yeah, you can parry him down and then cut it off. Yeah, I think I have to do that, I don't know. So, the method that you're doing right now mm -hmm. is in the direction of the version 2 of his weapon. Pardon me? So if you oh, okay, if you cut off both What's of- What's the difference? So you get a weapon anyway, and that's the yeah. version 1, but you can do- you can do an alternate method and you'll get, get version, version two. two? Okay. So if you cut off both his pincers before killing him, you'll get his second weapon. Don't I have to do that anyway to kill him? No. Uh. Got it. Got it. I don't know why that thing's still beeping. It's really weird. It's like it's still alive. But um, yeah, so the pincers on each side of his body are optional. But how else do you hurt him? I don't the, understand. The, like, coolant packs in the front of his face. Oh. The ones between the pincers. Does that kill them? Kill him more quickly? Yeah. So if you do the pincers, if you do both of the pincers, you get his special weapon, which I, you might want, because it's a twin rigged that does poison damage. Oh. Um, but yeah, if you want to just kill him faster, go for the, the coolant packs. I don't Fuck, fuck me. What's he doing now? I'm targeting no his leg. There you go. So yeah, if you target the cooling, so you're targeting the right one right now, which will kill him faster. Looked like he was upside down for a while. He kind of was. Just a very angry boy. Oh, how do you fucking dodge that one? Hmm, eye frames. Oh no. Also, someone pointed out that he's missing a leg too. Like he started with a with a leg missing already. That is a really annoying attack <laughs> to just throw in the middle of this bullshit. It's zone denial. Uh, he's a he's a smart fighting game character. Oh no! Oh, I was. I'm out of stamina, aren't I? Yeah. You are able to take a lot more hits with the Zade armor on now. <laughs> yeah, I suppose. 
There's also like later on you get a How lot many, of implants. So what, like, what what is my objective here to kill him? Uh, so you want to destroy those two bulbs? Yeah, those two bulbs in his face. Am I even targeting it now? I don't even no, see. No, you're targeting uh, one of his pincers. It'll be like a uh, shield, a yellow shield icon if you're targeting one of the bulbs. Of course. And then, um, once you do that, then you destroy the legs. I don't know what the difference is. So I think if you... Because if you destroy the legs first, they start ejecting poison at you, which basically adds more zone denial. Great. Unless you're wearing the equipment that's like, you do more damage if you are poisoned, which I guess is a plus. But, uh, yeah, I just saved the legs until after dealing with the coolant things. Just very aggressive. I can't believe this is the first, like, danger <laughs> boss in this game. It's... I'm trying to think of what the other boss that I fought was, because I've only fought, like, two bosses now, and I... It's hard to say if that one is easier or not. Its moveset is definitely, like, more clear, but, um, yeah, I don't know. I think they're just two different bosses. Maybe you'll have an easier time with that one. But I have faith. I think you can kill this guy. It'll just take some doing. Plus, you get to listen to some Matrix 2 music. I have no health. Uh, it's fine. It's fine. I don't know why he's not attacking you with his directional. Oh, there we go. Oh, I didn't even see the fucking arrow. Mm -hmm. Oh! Oh. Fuck, I hate <laughs> that, man. Blocking the first one I can always do, but then, like, it's... I get out of the rhythm. Fuck. Yeah. If you want, you can just dodge after the first one, like... Try to bait the attack, do the first one, and then leave, so you don't have to do, like, the back and forth. Yeah, it'll take forever, then, to bring him down. Eh. Nah, maybe I'll edit. We'll see. We'll see how I feel. Or I'll just leave it up here. I mean, you remember how long it took me to try to beat the rogue process. Uh, that... yeah, I do remember. But like, this is, again, the first boss in this fucking game, pretty much. Yeah, but it is more open world than the Surge one, so, like, he's not necessarily a blocker, he's just, like, advised to be the first boss. I just don't, like... I don't really see that these parries are so easily, like, telegraphed. Because mm -hmm. I can't really tell when it's gonna hit, or like how many frames of animation there are, or whatever, like... Yeah. That's definitely where the challenge comes in. You can also... Because like, in Dark Souls they do it where they have like huge wind-ups and stuff, but the characters are huge, right? Yeah. And I feel like the parry windows on... well, maybe not Dark Souls. The parry window in Sekiro is pretty high. Yeah. But also Sekiro, like, is designed around specifically just one parry. Where it's yeah. like parry, dodge, or duck. So you need to target one of his body parts. If you try to hit his face, you bounce. We can also try upgrading your weapon. Um, I don't know what... I don't know if it makes a difference if I can't parry him, though. Yeah. Make you, it'll make it so you have to parry him less, because he'll die faster. So you have no stamina there. Oh, fuck Kelly. <laughs> Uh, I, so I, I didn't have any stamina because I was just blocking the whole time? Yeah, so every time that you, you're like, basically your poise was oh. destroyed, your stamina went down. Um... It was fucking like seven meters after the watch. Yeah. So this guy before the boss, just start chopping his hand off, or his right hand off so you can get weapon upgrades. Because I think he's Mark Three, And then we can upgrade your, your twin rig to Mark Three. I think your spear right now was Mark Three, which is why we didn't think of it. Alright. Again, I don't know what difference it'll make if I can't parry him, though. Eh! Every little upgrade. It'll also give you arm upgrades, so you can upgrade your... your aid armor. We could also redistribute your stats, so you get more stamina. And less health? I don't know. Or less battery consumption. Or battery efficiency? Whatever it's called. Shkink. <sighs> At least you'll get two two heals from this guy. Yeah. 
Um, but I mean, like, if you're, if you have less health but more stamina, then it'll for it'll force you to do the parries perfectly. Yeah, that's the thing. I don't think the stats are really the issue. Hmm. I'll try targeting his. <clears throat> we can also just do a round where we don't talk, and I can clean it up in post. No, I don't mind that you talk. Um. Man, that's the first time I've heard that. Huh. <laughs> I also will sometimes just get frustrated at this guy and just, like, spam my my drone. Oh, wow. I don't know what happened there. I'm not too sure. He decided he didn't want to be uh, in front of you. What do I do in that case? Like, just gotta, just gotta dodge at the perfect time. Because your guy does have... Your girl does have quite a bit of uh, iframes. Shoot him with your drone a bit. Just fucking uh, yeah, just show fuck him who's boss. Fuck you. <laughs> it's very cathartic. There is also the fact that like, if we were off camera, we would basically spend just hours going and farming the area. What? I don't know. You dot. You blocked one of them. You only need to do one more parry now. Ouch. God damn it. I couldn't even see. I guess I got... No, yeah, no stamina. Uh, what the fuck? Also, I forgot about that. If you walk next to your scrap, like your dropped scrap, it'll actually heal you. That's interesting. Now um, will it not heal me anymore? Yeah. So I wonder if that's a strat. Like, just leave your scrap in the boss boss that's room and then occasionally get... kind of funny, yeah. Yeah. That is the case. That was weird. I've never seen his left hand target or do a right swing. Uh. I I don't remember, but I don't think you have to chop the little coolant things. I think once you destroy them, they just blow up. Nice. Good idea. Reset. Yeah. Recenter. I'll learn to can I'll learn to fucking parry the right one eventually. <laughs> one of these days. Yeah. I think it doesn't help that it comes immediately after parrying the left one. Yeah. These things don't help either. No. Although they are in a ring formation, so technically fuck. It's just creating a battle zone for yeah. you. Yeah. Nice. Alright, progress. One down. Just keep up the rhythm. Alright. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> if he just kept swinging on his right side, or your right side, then he could get you. Fuck. Yeah, you got plenty of battery now. <sighs> nice. Huh? Yeah, just keep it up. So yeah, I guess each leg represents a cooling battery thingy. And then the two things on his face represent them. So now go for his legs. Okay. So I had to do that first before I could target his legs? No. You can do them in any order. What does the coolant tanks being dead do exactly? Uh, I think you have, to, you have to destroy all the coolant tanks and then he overheats and explodes. It basically is health. Just destroy these parts and then he'll die. I would almost recommend to get them just about to be destroyed and then switch to another one until like all three of them are almost destroyed just so he doesn't shoot poison a lot. Okay. God damn it. Yeah, these ones are gonna be tough. Ugh. And I don't like this targeting system either where I have to keep pressing ult. Mm. Fun. You could untarget completely because it'll target once you start hitting them. Yeah. So if you just want to free roam a bit. 
Oh, what the fuck? Yeah, he won't How let am I you. supposed to hit him? He won't let you do a lot of hits on him. Or, uh... Build up any fucking battery, I guess. Yeah. I wonder if he's more aggressive after you destroyed his coolant faces. He can do the, like, dodge forward attack, and this then dodge out. fucking forever, dude. Fuck. <clears throat> Yeah, he's not a fast boss. It took me like 10 minutes just to take out his fucking coolant tanks. So let's upgrade your weapon so that it does more damage. Okay. That'll probably help. Actually, check your... So go into your weapons slot. Um, go over to your nano twin rigged. The purpley blue Swing ones. Here. And then press triangle. And then press right on the right stick. So they make it, it'll make it mark two. So they okay. do 105 damage with 43 nano damage. Um, I just don't know if the nano would pop if you're hitting them. Yeah. So it might just be worth to try to upgrade your SNR jackdaw. Yeah, for now. Your Jack Daniels. Uh, uh what do I need? Just uh, just some scrap. scrap. You okay. might have some tech scrap stocked, or kill some dudes. Because, yeah, I think extra damage will make it at least make each of the phases go faster. So you have to, like, you'll just have to parry less times. Oh, he's got you on edge now. He knows you're salty, so he's just attack. He's just yeah. trying to attack you more. <laughs> he's like, haha, J little Johnny has screwed this guy over so many times, and now I just beat him super easy. I don't think that'll be enough. You probably need like a thousand, maybe? Maybe 1500? Okay. I think you get some from killing these turrets, though, so. It should be fine. Just like clear up to the Welsh dude. Or clear around, maybe drop down and then kill the guy in the acid pit as well. And then by the time you get back to the med bay, you'll probably have enough. Maybe I should get his, uh. Arm, just, Fuck. or his weapon, just in is case. It, is it always the, um... It's always the right arm. Okay. Right arm's always weapon, and head is always implants. Oh, it's fine. Still get the tech scrap. Alright. It's already at 1.1 times, uh, tech increase, which is interesting. Basically, as you kill more people, you get more tech scrap from them. Do I need specific types of scrap for each weapon? No. Okay, just any thing yeah. will do. You get tungsten from weapons, uh, which can be then used for literally any weapon. That would suck if you had to farm on the people that had the weapon that you wanted to use. Und what? No Yeah, that one's un ability. unparryable. Yeah. Oh, Come shit. on! <laughs> Give yeah, me the, a fucking break here. The continuous attack from the, uh, the switch weapon is pretty hard. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, I thought that said your death has been average. Oh, I'm gonna get a cider. Okay. Do you want me to go pick up your scrap? Uh, sure. Okay. Maybe this, this cider will give you strength. Oh yeah, another thing uh, to remember is that if you're attacking um, armored parts, doing R1, L2, L2 does more damage, and then unarmored parts is... Oh yeah, okay. I'm gonna use R1. Just like Norris. <laughs> so yeah, if you're on the head, uh, it's like this really slow attack. No head for you. And then you get a bit of... You might actually be able to... Uh, what grade is this guy? 
Because your healing implant is... Mark 2? Oh, it's Mark 1 right now. Yeah, you should totally be able to upgrade that. Which basically gives you, like, an extra stock. Okay, that's good. Hey. Hey. L2. Oh, one. Uh, just keep spinning. Just always be spinning. <laughs> when people ask why you're not spinning, I'll just get you back. I think that should be enough to upgrade. So, thought there was a guy here. In mine, there's a guy here for some reason, and I don't know why there isn't in yours. It's very confusing. Even at the point when I was here on my own game, a man was there. It's very confusing. There you go. Oh, you did get enough tech strap. Okay. So yeah, we'll upgrade weapon. <clears throat> you should also be able to upgrade your injectable. One of them. Which Is that this one? Or? Whichever one's equipped. Hit L2, it'll go to equipped. Yeah. You can't? What do you... Oh, it's... Wait, 4,000? 4, Jeez. Yeah, it's a lot. Okay. You can't even upgrade your weapon, right? Oh, yeah, you can. Never mind. That'll help. Now it'll do a hundred and some odd damage. I guess we can increase something here, too. Uh, yeah. We can upgrade those as we go. I don't think there's any Mark IV guys. Sometimes they'll put, like, one guy that's higher level than everyone else around him, but he's, like, really hard. Mm -hmm. So that you can, like, go farm him if you want. But, uh, I do not think there is a guy here. I think this guy right here is kind of your, like, just before the boss, I'll collect one extra piece of armor so I can <laughs> upgrade when I go back. Or he's like, I'm gonna hit you a lot before you get to the boss and make you weaker. He's, uh, he's little Johnny's right-hand man. Apparently. He's part of the inner circle. <laughs> yeah, my, my boy out there might be addicted to the blue sparkle, but he's loyal, and that's what I look out for. He's, uh, Big Johnny. It's one of those ironic names. Yeah. Right? He's much skinnier than little Johnny. Tiny Johnny. The <laughs> most obese of them. <laughs> I actually used to be really thin, but then they kept, they kept complimenting me on my size, and I got really self-conscious, so I beefed up. And then I went a little bit overboard. Ironic names hurt too, people. <laughs> Maybe don't make a, a nickname that's entirely about the person's body. <sighs> ain't that, ain't that, ain't they real tiny dick slim, eh? <laughs> tiny dick slim. <laughs> <laughs> I got two of them. <laughs> I like that because it's, yeah, it's like you have a tiny dick as well as just being skinny. Yeah, and that's what we <laughs> Which love actually about. is kind of an unfortunate combination. You'd, you'd rather be like skinny but also have a big dick just to kind of buck the, the expectation. He you makes know? up for it in other ways. <laughs> yeah, exactly. He's really good with his hands and his mouth, but he's, nobody talks he's about that. He's a very generous lover. He tiny dick slim. <laughs> he, didn't, he didn't get called wiggle fingers or anything like that, which, you know, he really would have liked. Because that's talking more <laughs> about his ability to perform than any sort of physical appearance. But his friends weren't impressed with his ability to uh, satisfy women. No. <laughs> I feel like the mob really trying to, like, cut down anyone from being uh, happy with themselves. Yeah, they're pretty, but they're, they're kind of bastards, right? Ain't that, ain't that right, Mr. Weird Ears that stick out too far from his head? <laughs> You know, these nicknames don't really even make the regular name shorter, do they? No, just, not even a little bit. They're just meant to be kind of mean. You know, there's a guy down in Chinatown. They call him his nose is crooked to the left side a little bit, but it might have been from a sporting incident or a birth <laughs> defect. We're not too sure. You ask, you ask for him. Like, I have no idea who you're talking about. <laughs> oh, you'll know when you see him. It's an ironic name, though. His nose actually tilts to the right. <laughs> So yeah, don't pick up your, your tech, and let's see if it occasionally heals you. Yeah, that might be useful. Put your tech to work for you. Are Look, you I, in, need, I need my tech to work for me. Yeah, are you in tech debt? Are you sitting on mounds of tech that's doing nothing for you? Put your tech to work for you. Go ahead and die and leave a big puddle oh, of tech. Oh, fuck, no I stamina. It. No stamina. I fucking no had stamina. it, dude, fuck! <laughs> Great. <laughs> Just adds insult to injuries. Walk. Oh, you can get him to destroy his mines. I guess so. By slamming down on them. That's why they disappear after a while. 
There, there we, we go. go. They, they call me Perry's too much. I think you're targeting his body right now. Which will not be good to do. Alright. Try to look cool and that's already damaged. It does kind of look like he's less aggressive. I wonder if it almost would be beneficial to, like, just bring everything down to almost being destroyed so that you don't get him to go into, like, a different phase. Maybe, yeah. Although maybe there's something around that, too. He's like, wait, I know what this guy's doing. He's making me really weak and everything until the very end. No stamina. Seems to be a recurring issue I run into here. There is a stamina injectable, which would be a fun uh, use of battery. I'm uh, wary of using any other, any of these wild objective, uh, uh, injectables. Yeah, I've, I've not used any other injectable yet, and I'm like wondering if I'm... If you're playing the game right? Yeah. <laughs> Who's to know? They certainly don't, like, lack in options uh, of things to do. Yeah. Or things to take care of. It's a very um, challenging game. I'm glad that you're playing it. Yeah. I don't want people to see see me play games. Oh, you would be much better than me. <laughs> no, I gotta wait until the bad Souls game to play. Uh, w w like what? The, the, the two. Oh gosh, yeah. Numero, you guys get to play the fun ones. Dos. Even if you Even if you struggle with it, at least it's more fun than the one that I'm gonna have to do. That's a bad one, yeah. It's my penance. <laughs> Fuck. That's my jigsaw, jigsaw style punishment. <laughs> Kelly, you're right. You have made your friends play Souls games on the channel <laughs> for years now. Now you have to play the worst one. Sitting in front of you is Dark Souls 2. You have to play it while making content for the internet. All right, let's try your theory about destroying, just almost destroying yeah. things. Yeah. Yeah, because he doesn't do that like quick. Oh yeah, never mind. Oh my god. That one. You have two options. Either you make a really tanky You know what? Build. I had a, uh, a, a thought for these ones. Oh, because they're, cause you Cause got they're a more little, range? They're a little more out of range than the... Uh, yeah. You really need to do the, the jump forward attack. Because that, that thing is will get you in way better than walking. But that's working so far. All right. You've relied on your spear for so long. Here's a boss whose range oh, will not Oh, you matter. motherfucker! <laughs> okay. Do another one. <laughs> yeah. You have to cut off the pincers of the man sitting in front of you. He won't go lightly. Oh, man! Jump attack. Jump forward attack. Not that one. That was a slide. What's jump? Watch your stamina. What's jump? Just like dodging. The dodge in. Oh. Yeah, that one. Did I hit? No. He hit you. Good. What I wanted. You got the heals. Ooh, that one hit. Yeah, I think you were right about the range. Oh, oh you motherfucker! <laughs> I hate you! <laughs> The jump in attack is also very fast, so it's harder for him to dodge. But do not go for the follow up, and you have no stamina. Watch your stamina. Uh. Nice. He is getting some. He will get nano build up when you attack his face, apparently. Because you just hit, smacked his face a little bit, and he got nano build up. I have no fucking stamina. <sighs> so angry. Both no. Of you. Which of these angry men will will kill each other first? There's just isn't much damage to that fucking photo least. Yeah. Uh, okay. I think the middle one. I don't know. I don't know what to do anymore. I have no. You might want to switch. To, may switch to his face and try to parry to get some more uh, stamina uh... or some more battery. You're gonna have to rely on your parry abilities. Yeah, this is gonna be great. Do I get nice. stamina from shooting him? Oh, you do. Keep doing that. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's pretty cool, actually. Wow. Oh. Okay. Oh. Now, I, now I figured out something that the drone's useful for. I didn't even know that. Okay. Look at us. Look at us go. Learning stuff on the fly. 
Yeah, switch to one of his like. Oh yeah, yeah he still got that one. The back leg. Yeah. But he has lots of counter attacks when, when you get behind him. He does. He can bait him to slam his back leg down like that. Ugh. Because he'll do like back leg first and then the remainder other two legs. But you need to get in there quick. Oh, man. Nice. Nice. Yeah. Good read. Yeah. For him. Yeah. No, he, he <laughs> did, he's doing very well, honestly. Especially with his broken robot. So what happens if I... I just... He just gets stronger if I try to take out anything? Uh, if you break out a leg, poison will start seeping out of it. That's... Almost. One more. Nope. Just, uh, had no stamina and decided to swing. Does it even have a pixel <laughs> of fucking armor right there in that just, leg? You could just shoot it. Uh... Yeah, I could do that. Okay, I gotta go pee. I'll be right yeah, back. All right. All right, once more into the breach. Do not go quietly into that good night. Yeah, I'm just gonna unequip the other, uh... Which one was it? The... There we go. Yeah. Just have the two. I think it just, at this point, it just comes down to doing. It either comes down to doing or grinding until you're much higher yeah. leveled. Or we can go back and take my bad advice of, <laughs> of breaking <laughs> through the security. Uh. I found, like, a better way to get past the security, because I was like, I swear it was so much easier for me, but, um... I don't know. I have confidence that you can beat this boss. I'm gonna try the legs first now. Alright. No. Not like that. I don't know what the range of the poison is. Like, if he... If you, uh, destroy the legs and then resort to just attacking his body, like, how hard it's gonna be to not get hit by the poison? I'm not too sure. Who's to know? <clears throat> yeah, just... Gotta preserve that stamina, just like small pokes, poking his leg, and running away. He's doing like any follow up, and he'll he'll yeah, get you. He'll, he'll get you. Me. He's oh, like that. I'm know. trying to dodge under you, dude. Come on. <laughs> we also gotta get you some more omni cells, cause you only have ten now. There was like. I don't remember what equipment it is, but there's like you get plus Omni Cell for filling a battery meter, which is oh interesting. Yeah, I don't apparently, think apparently uh, battery efficiency actually affects the quality of the heal. That's the tooltip I saw. Wait, really? Yeah, oh. I said uh, increased battery efficiency for better heals. I think I said literally. Oh, I did not know that. Yeah, I thought I thought upgrading your um, what you call it. Like upgrading your actual implant would do that, but oh maybe that just affects how much you can store in them. Oh my god. That was a good camera. <laughs> good moment for the camera to do its thing. Mm -hmm. It's a dynamic camera, it's going for the cinematics. Okay, one, one more. Maybe? Uh, One more that. now. <laughs> Shoot it. <laughs> there you go. Alright, so that just has poison on it now. Yeah, now you'll just get poison when you're near that one. Oh my god. Which actually doesn't seem too bad. Yeah, I don't think it's... I thought it left, like, puddles, but I guess I'm wrong. It's just, like, when you get close to it. Yeah. yeah. Like, hey, don't stand next to his leg anymore. You did it. You beat this one. Oh, come on! Shoot it! <laughs> Get so many, uh, Omni cells that you can just shoot his leg to death. Yeah, that'd be funny. Oh, that didn't give you any meter. No, it didn't. So it's gotta be his body then? That's, uh, totally arbitrary. It makes a lot of sense. It's just, you can't, uh, uh. attack his appendages. Yeah. I'm not really getting much battery either, it seems like, but. Yeah. I wonder if, like, going back and forth from legs to um, body... No. Oh, that yeah, was close. See, that other one is really quick, and the second one is... first one is slow. Mm-hmm. This is, like, sort of like an over-designed boss. 
in my opinion. Yeah, I um, can see that. There just seems to be like there's f fucking five different points, five different health like spots you have to attack. There's mines. There's goop. There's fucking like swing attacks. There's parry attacks. There's uh, poison. 